Hey everybody, it's Kneecap here, and welcome to This Week in WoW for the week of July 9th. As always, we'll go ahead and start with the Mythic Plus affixes. This week we have Teeming, uh, or Fortified Teeming and Quaking, uh, and of course the new affix Beguiling, I believe, will come out today. This is the brand new affix, so say to go by to Reaping, one, one, one that I was actually really good with uh, as a Rep Paladin. It was nice just being able to just destroy everything really fast. Uh, but yeah, so again, one more time, Fortified teaming, quaking, and hopefully the new one, uh, which I believe is beguiling. Um, so let's go ahead and talk about what else is going on this week. So this is another exciting week because we have the raid coming out this week. So we have the Eternal Palace. This will be on normal and her heroic difficulties unlocked. We'll have season three starting uh, as well, like I mentioned. So that, again, that's why we should have the new Mythic Plus affix. And we'll also have, there's a the PvP battle bonus event. There's a PvP brawl as well this week. And uh, the thing I'm most excited about is Mechagon unlocking this week. So uh, Mechagon was the new dungeon. It's like Karazhan, the new Karazhan that's like an eight boss dungeon. It's very large, uh, takes a lot of time to do. The first clears of it, I imagine, are going to take quite a, quite a while to do as well. It's basically like Mythic uh, BOD but as a dungeon form, five-man dungeon form. So it's, it's a little bit rough, so you know people are probably going to have some pretty stiff requirements at first for groups as well, but that can be a good thing. Uh, so we have, like I said, new raid, new dungeon, new season starting, new everything this week. We have PvP Brawl, we have PvP Battle. People are doing more PvP right now to unlock essences and to uh, gain honor or artifact power uh, in general. Also, this week, we do have the Dark Moon Fair as well. So this is also, uh, I always will mention this, it's a good way to get professions up, first of all. I always say that. But it's also a good way, uh, right now, to get the rep uh, boosting. Either get the top hat, go ride the roller coaster, etc. Get the get the rep boosting. Because right now, if you're trying to get some artifact power to unlock some more essences and stuff, uh, turning in the 10k rep bonus thing for once after you're exalted... Those give you a decent amount of AP, and you can get more uh, rep by just uh, just getting that buff from the Dark Moon Fair and uh, increasing the rep you might get, and therefore increasing the artifact power that you get. We also have uh, Luminous Luminaries, so I don't even uh, know what this is, so I'm actually just going to read it here. Um, GG Engineering has discovered luminous, luminous creatures in the depths of Ashir. Uh, they need your help to research the creatures before they disappear into the deep sea once again. So apparently we're going to go to Vashir for this. I'll probably have to check this out. This is on Saturday, um, the 13th, so that's kind of cool. I, I mean, maybe it's cool, maybe it's dumb, but I'll definitely check that out. The thing I'm most excited for is the new dungeon. Uh, that's where my best essence is as well, at least as of now, the way they're simming. So I'm excited to get my essence. I'm excited to... Uh, yeah, to just run the new dungeon, I will record that and uh, at least post the bosses uh, from the fights uh, just just for fun, basically. Uh, probably not, maybe with some music with it, I don't know. But at least post the bosses, probably not the trash, because it's probably going to take quite a while to run the first time. Unless I get in, unless uh, my guild's all online or something and we can form some good groups that way. But yeah, I'm, I'm definitely excited for this week, almost more than the very beginning of the patch, just because, uh, yeah, you know, I'm flying now, we got a bunch of the new raid, new dungeon coming out, everyone's upgrading their essences, everyone seems to be doing content, so that's kind of cool. So yeah, uh, as always, please subscribe to the channel, that helps me out a lot, and everybody, have a good one.